Friday is only a week away and if you're anything like me I love a good sale I love a good bargain and so in the run-up to Black Friday I'm bringing you a different clothing haul every day of the week so we have seven clothing hauls coming your way starting off today with Tui from Sainsbury's which is a brand new shop to the channel I have never done a Tui haul on my channel before and I'm always excited when I get to test out a new brand so I've got a lot of stuff a lot of stuff we've got blazers pajamas dresses jumpers skirts we've got everything so that we can give Tui a good and proper testing so that I can let you know what I think I will leave the links to everything that I'm trying in today's haul in the description box down below and I will put the prices on the screen but just bear in mind that they may change throughout the week because in the run-up to Black Friday brands often do different sales depending on the day of the week like on Monday it might be one price on Wednesday it might be another so do just check the links down below if you want to check out the most up-to-date price on all of these items and see if you can get a bargain I will try and keep the prices in my description box updated throughout the week so that you can see and if you do shop from any of my links thank you so much they are affiliated which means I make a small amount of commission at no extra charge to you but it also shows the brands that you've been watching my videos and it means that hopefully more and more brands will want to work with me in the future so any purchases that you do make off the back of my links are really appreciated but there's no pressure to use my links either way so I'm really really excited like I said to jump into this haul I've never done a haul from Tui but I've heard amazing things and you guys know how much I'm loving Asda at the moment so I thought let's try out some more supermarkets so we're testing out Tui today and you'll have to let me know if you want me to do a Tesco's haul this week as well because I could be very open to that everything that I'm trying today is in a 20 or a 22 I am about a 22 at the moment some places I'm a 20 some places I'm a 24 you know how these sizes are they can be a little bit hit and miss but I will leave in the description box all the sizes that I've tried today as well in case that is helpful and I am five foot nine which is something that I get asked all the time so before we jump on in if you are new here or if you've watched a few of my videos and you haven't yet subscribed then I would love it if you wanted to press that subscribe button and join my channel it costs you nothing but it basically one supports me as a creator and two it means that whenever you go onto YouTube if I post a new video they will let you know so that you can keep up to date especially this week with the seven clothing hauls that I have going your way so now is the perfect time to subscribe if you haven't already and let me know down in the description box if you do subscribe off the back of this video so I can say a massive thank you all that aside let's jump on in to this haul because I am so excited about this top I am going through a massive declutter of my wardrobe at the moment part two of that is coming soon I'll link part one up in the cards in case you haven't seen it but what I've realized in this declutter is I have pretty much no tops left I've got like a couple of tops and so I'm really trying to spruce up my top wardrobe and uh, get some more tops back into my life because I'm really enjoying wearing like shirts and jeans or like skirts and a top at the moment and I can't just keep wearing the same top over and over again. So I've got a couple of tops to try and a couple of skirts. So we'll talk about the top first because this is so soft it feels like a jumper but it isn't as thick as a jumper it's really really thin it's got almost a ribbed no it ha it's not almost it, it is ribbed <laughs> um hopefully you can see that there is a ribbed texture to it and it is a turtleneck so I've got this tucked over but it isn't too tight it's just like it's nice and warm you know me I never like my clothes to feel really tight around the neck but there's no like th there's no pressure there it just feels really nice and warm and it is so soft I've got this in another color so we'll try that on with the other skirt that I've got so that you can see them both it is a really really good length and it's nice and stretchy this I got in a 20 I, I could have got it in an 18 it's quite generously sized but I think a 20 is really nice for where I'm at right now I just love how nice and soft the sleeves are they're a really cozy length and this was really quite affordable I can't remember the exact price but like I said it'll be on the screen for you and um, so if you can get this in the sale it's even more of a bargain because I think it was only like 16 pounds to begin with um, and it's just so 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 soft I can see me absolutely living in this I will definitely be keeping both this and the other color um, so like I said I'll show you that when I get to the next skirt but I'm 
really really loving the quality of this so if you're looking for just a really nice soft cozy basic turtleneck thicker than a t-shirt not as thick as a jumper then I would definitely recommend this because it's just so so soft tucking it back in so that I can talk to you about the skirt now I got this in a size 22 and it's a really fun black and white ruffle skirt it's got a bit of an underskirt going on and then the top layer is sheer I think this is really pretty the sizing just isn't quite working for me because at the top it's not like it's, it's, it's not that it's like baggy but I can feel that it's a little bit loose like can you see there's a little bit of gaping going on with the back it is elastic on the back so that's really good so I think for the best fit for me I'd need a 20 but then around the waist uh, well no around like my belly area it isn't the loosest like it feels a little bit it's not tight like you can see there is fabric there but I think if I sized down to a 20 it would be too clingy here so it would fit here but not here um so you know that's just something to note but it's really cute it's really fun I love the little ruffles like it's got a really nice amount of movement to it like I, I do like it I don't think it's my favorite thing favorite skirt in the world um I can't I don't know if it's the way that it's like hugging on my hips a little bit I'm not sure I think it's fine I do think it's fine but because I know that I'd have to like get a different size and then it's probably going to be a bit tighter on the belly and you know it's just feeling like there's too many barriers to it being the right skirt for me and I've just decluttered so much from my wardrobe that I'm trying to be really conscious of only like keeping things that I know I'm going to love and wear I don't want to be keeping things that are just going to sit there and gather dust and I think that whilst I like this I love other things more that I would reach for so the top I'm keeping without a doubt I can see the place for it I'm so excited about it it's so soft it's great quality but the skirt I'm just like it's fine I'm just not loving it so as promised this is the same top but in cream this just feels even softer if that's even possible like I am so obsessed with these tops like I couldn't recommend these enough they just feel the most cozy um so yeah everything I said about the black top applies to the cream top if they have this in other colors I would be tempted because it's just a like a nice chocolate brown like this kind of brown that would be so nice I don't know if they do I'm gonna have a look after because I will pick this up in other colors if they have it because it's just so cozy so yeah this is it in the cream and I absolutely love it then this is the second skirt and I got this in a 20 and I think it's fitting much better it's a really cute is it like paisley pattern um with the like greens and the purples and then it's a bit of um a it's got a bit of a pleat in the fabric now it does have elastic again at the back so that's great and it's a really cute length I just I don't know something's throwing me I don't think it's the fit I think I love the fit of the skirt I think it's just the pattern I think it's maybe I don't know if it's a bit too dark like if I'd want it to be a little bit more vibrant I just feel like it's not it's not making me super excited like I love the fit so I'm gonna see if they have this skirt in like a different style um like different colorway maybe um because I really do like the fit of it and I think that this is a really nice like um wintry outfit for work throw on some tights if it gets too cold but um <laughs> I keep having my legs out at the moment and being like why am I doing this <laughs> it is like five degrees put some tights on uh, but if a dress is like long enough I'm like Ugh, I'm gonna just have my legs out until they absolutely freeze off <laughs> but all that aside I just think it's I think it's the colour for me so you'll have to let me know what you think because I'm kind of on the fence I could go either way um but I do think the fit is really, really nice. So I'm gonna see if they have it in a different color, um, maybe a different style, but definitely enjoying the fit. Just just something about the color is, and, and the pattern maybe is throwing me. So let me know what you think. But again, rec I honestly recommend these tops so, so much. Um, so yeah, really excited about the top. Not so sure on the skirt, need your opinion. Oh, and whilst I'm here, I got a blazer now I am not a blazer girly I don't know what to do with blazers I buy them because I think they look cute and then I never wear them but I really want to be a blazer girly so I'm trying I'm trying I got this in a 20 uh, it is 25 pounds full price 
let's see I'm not I don't know that this is necessarily what I'd pair it with but I thought we'd give it a go uh let's put it on it does have like a ruched sleeve to it so let's see I mean it looks a little bit weird with the like jumper hanging out so I didn't think about the fact that the ruched sleeve would make them shorter so I don't know about that but I don't know guys I really want to be that cute girl in the office in a blazer hang on my turtleneck is all folded up I just don't know also I'm finding that with the ruching when I go to bend my arms it feels really tight here on the like um shoulder area so I don't think this is the blazer for me because of because of that I, I just feel like it hides any shape it just boxes me off I just maybe I need a, no I don't think I like the idea of a cropped blazer I was gonna say maybe I need a cropped blazer but I don't think I like that idea maybe it's just not for me I don't know I'm not sure it was an experiment you <laughs> tell me how to dress a blazer and make it work for me um not everything works for everyone so maybe I'm just not a blazer girl but I want to be so help me but yeah no this is absolutely fine I just don't like the way that the ruching makes it like cropped on the on the sleeve and also the way that it feels tight when I'm bending my arm so this isn't a winner for me it's not bad like it's it's not too thin not too thick but it's just not working for me but tell me what to do with the blazer send me some links send me some pinterest send me some photos i don't know help me figure this out because i, I want to be i want to be that girl <laughs> um but yeah unfortunately this isn't going to work for me next up i have this absolutely gorgeous jumper i got this in a 20 because i am smaller on the top and because it is a bit more of a short jumper i thought a 20 would do well this is 25 pounds full price it says it's a delicate item so due to the delicate nature of this yarn please take extra care with jewelry to avoid snagging the garment i do think that you could snag this quite easily so i'm going to keep this away from summer if i keep it but it's again super super soft i think it's beautiful they did have this in two colors um so i'm going to give this a try now but i just thought this is absolutely gorgeous so let's see let's see how i feel about it on but it's got a little bit of weight to it as well actually but it's really soft um which i always want with a jumper so this is the jumper on i do really like it i kind of feel like i don't I'm, i feel like it's an odd in betweeny length like it's hitting on my hips and i usually want things to be like above or under um i'm not sure i don't know but i think it's really really cute i love the neckline like that it's a thicker chunkier neck i think it's so cozy and warm i love the pattern and the design it just feels really really nice i just i don't know about the way that it's fitting on me like I keep feeling like I want to just like pull it up a little bit I don't know but there is nothing wrong with this jumper it's so freaking cute I'm just trying to think about like how I'd style it May, let me know maybe with jeans but I don't hmm I don't know how I'd style this let me know but the jumper itself is absolutely gorgeous I really really love it I'm so impressed with the quality so far like it just feels so soft and cozy and warm um so yeah I really really like this I just need to think carefully about what like how I'd wear it um because I don't wear the most amount of jumpers so I'm still figuring these things out and um, so let me know what you think but in terms of the jumper itself I absolutely love it it's perfect for winter perfect for coming into christmas just got some thinking to do about what i'd wear it with next up we have this really fun vibrant blue dress it has sort of a cheetah print in the fabric but it isn't so obvious it's kind of like a little bit hidden a little bit disguised i do have this on in a size 22 i think that works i think I, just, I think a 20 would have worked I think it would just be a little bit more clingy so I'd probably stay in this size just by preference of how clingy I would want this dress to be um so I think that this is the right size for me I really like the fit on the chest like I like this um it's not a neckline it's not a chest line it's a hem it's a seam you know I like the way it's looking and I really like the sleeve style as well I think it's a really fun length like it's coming up like 
just above the ankles, but a bit, a couple of inches above the ankles. I like this. I'm not normally one for like an animal print, but I think because it's a little bit more subtle, I kind of like it. And the colour as well. I don't really have much in this colour at all, but I just think it pops and I really do like it. It is a bit of a sort of bouncier fabric, like there's a lot of stretch to it. So it does make it a little bit heavier, but not heavy in that it feels heavy on my skin, but heavy in that it's kind of like hugging and showing off the curves. I think that this could be quite a fun like alternative Christmas dress. Um, I don't know, I, there's something about like a really nice deep vibrant blue that feels a little bit Christmassy to me. I don't know why because it's not like the traditional like red or green or whatever but it is giving Christmas party to me so you'll have to let me know what you think. Um, but yeah like I said I really like the top. I think this is my favourite half of the dress, or favourite third of the dress, should I say. Um, but yeah, I think it's fun, I think it's cute, this is how she's looking from the back. Um, it's quite different for me for a lot of reasons, like the colour, uh, the animal print, so you'll have to let me know. I'm not going to say it's my favourite dress in the world, but I think it's fun, and I think it's a bit different, and pushing me out of my comfort zone, because my wardrobe is looking very, like, black, white and pink at the moment. Um, so we need to bring some more vibrancy into it. So yeah, you'll have to let me know what you think because yeah, I think I like it. I'm not like, I'm not 100%. I'm not like, you know, head over heels, but it's, it's fun. But yeah, let me know what you think because I'm really curious to hear your thoughts. Next up we have something that is definitely very me, very in my comfort zone, very classic for my style. It's a really cute, short, very short dress. Uh, this is in a 22 and it does have a little underskirt, underskirt, underdress. It's one of those like strappy camis, but it is kind of attached to the dress, which is good because it means you don't lose it, but it's bad because I always get so tangled putting them on. Like I put my arm through one arm, but not through the spaghetti strap and it just becomes a bit of a disaster. Um, so, you know, there's pros and cons to everything in life. I do like this. I love the colors. I love the fabric. I love, you know, like the general design. I think it's just a bit too short. I would wear this with tights for sure, but I just think if it could come down like another two inches, I'd be a lot more comfortable. It's not that I couldn't make it work. I could definitely make it work, but I just think my preference would be for it to be a little bit longer. I'm kind of straying away from like the super, super short dresses these days. I still like a short dress, but I just want it to like, you know, come to here. Just just give me a little bit more room to maneuver. Cause like, of course I'm gonna wear tights underneath, but it still just feels, I don't know, just a little bit too, too, too short for me. It's not, it's not bad. Um, but you know, it's just not, it's not quite there. Just give me another inch or two of fabric and it would be. Um, it has got an elasticated cuff, but they're not like, you know, those, it, it, it's not feeling skin tight. Like there's a lot of room around there. The fabric's really cute. It's got a bit of like um, gold thread going through it. Hopefully you can see that on camera, but it just adds a really nice touch. And I do like the little ruching layers. I like that it has an elastic panel around the waist so it cinches you in. So it's not bad at all. I really do like it. I just wish it was just, just a teeny, just a teeny bit longer. So yeah, it's definitely, um, a really cute dress. I just think for my preference at the moment, it's not quite there. But again, I'm impressed with the quality. I'm impressed with the fit. Um, I'm impressed with the price. So yeah, I'm, I'm really enjoying everything so far. It's just not quite what I'm looking for in terms of preference right now. Next up, I have a couple of jumper dresses. I have been living in jumper dresses recently as it's getting colder and colder. And this looks like it's going to be a nice addition to my jumper dress collection because I absolutely love it. I cannot believe this is £20. Like I actually cannot get my head around it. Uh, I've got this in a 22. Now part of me thinks that I would want it in a 20 but part of me likes how oversized it is. Like it just adds to the cosy vibe. So you'll have to let me know. Like I don't think I'd want it to be clingy but is this just too baggy? Like let me know what you think because I could go either way because I think 
both have like you know again pros and cons um but i love this so so much it's really like nice and soft on the outside on the inside it isn't quite as soft but it's not bad it's just not you know like as you know i just want to keep touching it on the outside it's not like that on the inside but it's not bad um it does have some nice slits on the side which i like they come to a really nice length like this is something that i would absolutely still wear my legs out with at the moment like i know it's like five degrees whatever um but i feel like with a jumper dress that's this long I'd probably just have my legs out. I think with some little ankle boots, it looks really cute. I could get like a belt to cinch this in at the waist. I think that would be nice with like a thicker belt, something a bit more chunky. And I like that we've got, again, the turtle neck on the neck. Um, but this isn't like, it's not even touching my neck. It's like a really wide neckline. I, I really, really do love this. And like I said, I cannot believe it's only £20. I just... I, I I think that my preference is to keep this in a 22 and have it be quite loose and baggy. But like I said, let me know what you think. But I am so happy with this. I love the colour. It's like an OT neutral kind of colour. I've never really been like a jumper dress, a jump, a, a jumper dress girly before. But this winter, I'm all here for it. It's honestly all I've been wearing um so yeah I really really like this highly recommend 20 quid I can't get my head around that and if you can get it in the sale for Black Friday it's going to be even more of a discount so I'm really excited about the other jumper dress I've got to try now um because this is absolutely staying and I do think it's staying in a 22 so yeah really excited about this one let me know what you think but it's just so cozy it's perfect and I'm so excited so next up we have this dress which I was calling a jumper dress but it's kind of like a hybrid like it's as thin as like a normal t-shirt dress but it's got this like fuzzy fabric going through it that makes it feel like a jumper but it really is more of a t-shirt dress I got this again in a 22 this I'm less keen on like I don't I, I don't know what it is about the fuzziness that I don't like the feel of. I really can't explain it, but do you know sometimes like a texture or a feeling just throws you and for some reason like it's super soft, it's super cozy, but it feels a tiny bit jarring to me and I cannot explain it to you. I really wish I could, but I can't. Um, I feel like it's just highlighting everything in a way that I just can't quite ignore um it's not that it's too small it's just a lot more clingy but like in a really obvious way um yeah i just i'm not i'm not so sure i don't really love the color either it's like a weird charcoal i can't like it's, it's like a gray but it's almost got like a tint of green in it but i don't even know if that's quite showing on camera um but this is the fabric with the like like it's got the lines that go through and then this is like the fuzzier bit that I was talking about. I think it's fine. There's just a few things that are throwing me and when that last jumper dress made me feel so cozy and warm and cute, this just doesn't compare. So I'm going to say no. I mean, it's an 18, it's, it's an 18, it is 18 pounds. Um, like I said, this is in a 22, it's 18 pounds. So it's an absolute bargain. Like I'm really impressed with the prices at uh, Tui. Um, but it's just yeah i don't know something's throwing me you'll have to let me know what you think um but if i feel this thrown now i'm not going to reach for it so there's no point keeping it i'm going to keep the space for things that i really love like the last one um and yeah let this one go back it's not awful i'm just not super excited so i'm going to say no to this one next up we have this absolutely gorgeous blue and white shirt dress i love a good shirt dress this is beautiful. I love the fabric. I love the colours. I, yeah, I really, really like it. I do need to get a smaller size. This is in a 22 and it's a very, very generous size. Like, I'm quite confused, to be honest, about how this is a 22. Like, let me just double check because, you know, when you like questioning yourself. Uh, yeah, this is a 22. I think that I need to size down to like an 18 in this and I'm not an 18. I'm definitely like a 20, 22. So this is very, very oversized and I can, you know, cinch it in with the tie and make it look like it's not as oversized, but I definitely think that 
but there's a lot of excess fabric so I would definitely recommend sizing down in this dress but it's really cute it's a great length it feels really nice and soft oh I do really like this I love how poofy the sleeves are the only thing I'm not in love with is that there's some like elastic running through this part of the design like can you see I don't think that's needed I would have rather it not have that but it's not enough to put me off the dress because for the most part I really really do love this I just need to you know like I said size down get it in so it's fitting me the way I want it to but yeah I really really do love this it's giving me like Greece vibes Santorini oh I wish I was on an island in the sun right now instead it's raining and horrible outside but you know it's it's fine because Christmas is coming Christmas is coming and it makes all of the bad weather worth it um but yeah no I absolutely love this I think it's a little bit loose on the top but I'm hoping that when I size down it's going to fit a bit better here but I really really think this is great this is the kind of thing that I love wearing to the office and then you can go for after work drinks and still feel really cute and dressed up um so yeah love 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 this just think the sizing is a little bit crazy um so I'm definitely gonna get this I'll probably get this in an 18 and I think that'll fit perfectly um but again it feels like amazing quality I'm so 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 impressed with the quality and the price of these pieces from Tui so yeah I think this is a definite keeper I just need to change the size but I love it love it love it love it love it let me know what you think now Next up is a dress that I had high hopes for but it's really not working. It is a very straight up and down slinky sexy cute dress. Now I got this in a 22 and I don't know what size I would have had to have sized up in for it to work on the belly but it would have not worked on the top. This is not working in any way shape or form. I find these dresses so so hard to make work because of where I carry the majority of my weight but I just don't have like you know if I want to go out dancing go to the club have some cocktails have a good night I don't really have a lot of outfits for that at the moment and I thought that this would be amazing um but I absolutely hate hate the way like and no amount of shapewear or sucking or anything is gonna make this work it also came ripped um like you can see here it's ripped away so that's unfortunate um but there is nothing about the fit of this i love the fabric oh god i hate this uh, i love the fabric i really do it's really slinky and sexy and fun um but the fit is an absolute no no so i'm gonna call this the first disaster um so this is this is a no for so many reasons i can't wait to take this off of my body so yeah i'm gonna go and get this off now um but even if it wasn't ripped like things happen like maybe someone tried this on and damaged it maybe it got damaged i don't know in in storage or whatever like things do happen um but that aside the fit was it's just it's just it's so clingy here here specifically like I don't understand I, I really I just yeah like I don't I really I, I don't get it I don't get it I don't like it it needs to come up my body right now um but I really do need to find some really cute fun going out outfits um so let me know if you've got any ideas for me pop the links in the description um because maybe I'll do like a going out dress haul maybe that could be a good thing and um, you'll have to let me know uh, but yeah this one is not it so second to last we have this really cute boxy khaki green crop not it's not a crop top but it is cropped like you, it's still coming down to like my belly button i really like this now i know this isn't everyone's vibe it's not even 100% my vibe i'm still getting used to the whole having my stomach on show in jeans but it's something I'm toying with at the moment. I'm getting more comfortable. I'm stepping out of my zone. I'm trying new things. Um, I do need more jeans because this is the only pair of jeans that I have that fit me and even these don't fit right. So I do have some jeans coming in over hauls this week. Um, so keep tuned, stay tuned for those. Um, but I think this is so cute. I got it in a 20, um, but it, it is quite an oversized style. But for me, I think I probably would have wanted it just a little bit bit smaller so I would I don't know though because it's the style isn't it it's meant to be a little bit oversized so maybe I would keep it in a 20 but I'd be torn I kind of want both I want an 18 and a 20 because you know they'll do different things um but I just think this is really fun it is ribbed as well it feels really nice it's a really nice color this is it from the back 
yeah I really do like this I just need to get the right jeans and then I think I would be super super in love um so I think I'm keeping this for sure just trying to decide if I want it in an 18 or in the 20 let me know what you think because I do it is the style isn't it it's meant to be a bit like it's it, it literally said boxy on it like it's meant to be a little bit oversized so maybe maybe it's good as it is yeah no it is I figured it out we actually made a decision I'm not the best at making decisions at the at the most of times um so yeah I love this I think it's really cute I'm excited to play with it like I said I know it's not everyone's style but I really like it and I'm very excited um so yeah this is a definite keeper I'm actually see if they have it in different colors but I love it in this like khaki green um so we've got one more thing coming up and I'm so excited because it's the most beautiful pair of pajamas so I'm hoping that they fit me well because I'm in the need I need Need some new pajamas so let's see keep your fingers crossed for me guys look at these pajamas how stinky cute are these I'm so 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 excited look at this print like how beautiful is this I am actually obsessed I am gonna buy more pajamas from Tui because I'm very, very excited. They feel so nice and silky. I got them in a 22 and whilst I could have got them in a 20, I don't think I'd want to because for me, I think with pajamas, I want them to be a little bit looser. I wanna feel comfortable. Um, but these are absolutely stunning. So this is how the trousers look. They're not the most high-waisted in the world, but they're high-waisted enough. They've got an elastic waistband this is the top like they just feel so nice oh my gosh i feel amazing in these like i was looking yesterday on asos and i was seeing some of these like chelsea pierce pajamas which i'm not saying that they're probably not the best feeling pajamas in the world i've never touched them i can't comment but some of them were like 50 60 pounds for a pair of pajamas and i was like i can't i can't i can't i can't i just cannot justify that but these i'm not saying that the quality is going to be as good but they are very much good enough for what i need in my pajamas like these are so so nice that being said if i'm missing a trick with these chelsea pierce pajamas let me know because i might try them but i just can't i just £60 for a pair of pajamas, £60, I just, I don't know, I don't know, let me know, uh, let me know if you like love them and they're your like ride or die and I'm missing out on something, but these are stunning, I'm so 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 excited and I tried these on last because I knew full well that if I liked them I would be keeping these on for the rest of the day, which is what I'm gonna do. So yeah, that was today's haul, thank you so so much for watching, I will be back tomorrow with a H&M haul and I'll be back every day for the next seven days with a different haul. Most of it's ordered, but there's still a couple more to order. So if there's any brands you want to see in particular, let me know. And if you're enjoying this series, if you give me a thumbs up, I'd really appreciate it. And I'll see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Bye.